How's it going everyone? It's Bright Guys Cards here and today we're going to be uh, going into the past a little bit here. Uh, today we're going to be opening up a Sword and Shield Darkness of Blaze booster box. So my buddy did give this uh, box to me for free. It was a really nice uh, gesture from him. It was kind of my birthday. Bought me a, uh, bought me this and I've been kind of holding it on ever since then. Uh, honestly, I haven't, I have a whole bunch of like a uh, Every single, well not every, sorry, not every single ETB that I haven't opened up, I keep the box and I uh, put it against uh, this uh, wall. So I kind of have like an ETB wall where I kind of have all the uh, ETB boxes. And I don't know, it's kind of just like a little collection thing I have going on. Honestly, I love it. So, uh, you know, I got to keep it. I got to keep it going. So luckily enough, I have never uh, opened up any of the, uh, I haven't opened up a Darkness of Blaze one. So he did give it to me for free. The dice are really nice. I like that. So that was really nice of him. Um, I'm just going to show the sleeves off pretty quickly. And then we'll go get into the packs. Oh, we do have the code card in here. I'll give you guys that as well. Sometimes I forget to give out the uh, ETV code card. Just because I completely forget that there is one in there. But uh, yeah. So you know what? This has to go into collection. Okay. I'm struggling with this right now. So we'll quickly just show it off. There's the sleeves if you haven't seen it. They're very, very nice. I'm going to put this aside here and then I'll, uh, I've already struggled with that enough. And I'll, uh, figure it out after. But, uh, yeah, it was a really nice gesture by him, so. Uh, but I, I also do want to open up some packs. And I do have them all, other, all the other ones are opened up. So it's, uh, it's a wall of opened up ETVs. So I figured, you know what? Oh, there's a code card for you guys. Do you know what I figured what? You know what I figured? We'd open this up and, uh, let's see how, kind of how we do. Uh, this is one of the first Sword and Shield sets. Uh, it's not not that great of a set, to be quite honest. Got the Struggle Glove. Ooh, but we do get we do get the Eternus V Max right to, right at the start. In so wow, that was look at that. That's pretty awesome. Nice little Rainbow card to start up the video right off. Uh, yeah, the set isn't too crazy. Uh, there is a Charizard V Max. I think that is probably the best card in the set. It's probably everyone's chase card. Oh, this uh, these hold cards just want to be the actual right way this time. Uh, so that is probably the biggest chase card of the set, and uh, you already have it uh, happily enough. I think I just pulled it like randomly. I was able to uh, got the Greedent and the Hydrodon, uh, non hollow rare. Yeah, I just randomly uh, pulled it. So that was uh, pretty exciting. It was awesome to kind of get that card. Uh, which is, I think I remember it being out of like a random like, you know, uh, box. Like one of those boxes, like <laughs> just like a, pro a Pokemon promo box. And it came with like four packs. And I think it was like literally like one pack of Darkness of Blaze, which is uh, pretty nuts. Uh, so I kind of feel like I have... Uh, the majority of the cards out of the set so i don't really need too too much i will say as well there is a really nice uh butterfree card that is uh i don't know what it is if you guys ever seen it in person it just looks really nice so that is uh pretty awesome you know there's not a not a whole lot of love for butterfree but i think uh if you're if you ever get the chance to see that card or if you do have that card have a look at it really nice uh card the butterfree rainbow card definitely did uh Butterfree some justice and very nice. We got the scissor V card. Very nice. I was just looking for my sleeves. You know what? Uh, we're we're doing pretty good for hits. You know what? That's not too not too bad. Uh, for master set for this uh, for this set, I actually haven't never started one for this set. I'm just gonna get rid of some of this garbage here. Never done a master set for uh, Darkness Blaze. Maybe something in the future I can kind of put together these packs just. Do not want to. <laughs> oh no, they do not want to open up today. I don't know, just they're just kind of ripping weird. Uh, yeah. So, Master Head, I haven't started one for this. Maybe at some point I will. Some point in my life I will. I get one done for this set. Uh, cards probably aren't too pricey. These ones are really off centered. If you can't, uh, if you haven't already been able to tell, they're really, really off centered. So uh, it's a little unfortunate. But yeah, this is uh, one of the first Sword and Shield uh, sets to kind of come out. So it is really nice to kind of see it 
Honestly, the cards kind of look like vintage, like, oh, not vintage, but like, I don't know, some of the cards just look pretty funny, to my opinion. Got the Skarmory, got Tita, Grimer, and we got the Vickavolt full art. Very nice. Oof. <laughs> I'm, uh, you know what, I'm presently surprised. I, you know, I figured I was going to kind of get nothing too crazy out of this, uh, out of this box, but I feel like we're, we've done pretty well. I've had about three hits. I think it, uh, I don't remember if it was 10 packs or 8 packs. I want to say 8 packs because that's generally how many packs. Oh, I messed that up. Well, we're just going to go through this. Wait, what? Okay. We're just doubling up on, uh, we're just doubling up on that card. Oh, sorry, I forgot, I forgot about the reverse holo. Uh, okay, we'll just continue on. I don't know, I'm confused. I don't know what the odds of that happening are, but it happened. We have the Blaziken Hollow. Yeah, I, I messed this up somewhere. I don't know where I messed it up, but I, I messed it up. I definitely messed that up. Uh, sorry about that. Anyways, we're going to move on to our last pack here. Last pack of Darkness of Blaze. It's kind of fun to see this set opened up again. It'd be awesome if we can get that Charizard V Max. But you know what? I'm I'm not disappointed if we don't. We did pretty well for uh, for what we've opened up. I got the Larion, I got the Rowlet, oh, there we go, we're not uh, focusing here, Starly, Purloin, got the Melton Reverse, and the Diggersby, uh, non hollow Rare. Alright, let's uh, kind of see how we did, go through all that bulk later on, uh, I probably put a Reverse Hollow in there somewhere, I feel like I did. Got the Hoopa, the Hoopa's nice, I don't think I've ever seen that Hoopa, I don't think I'll go through the rest of them. Our non hollow rares, our two hollow cards, and finally, we did get a V, a full art, and finally, a rainbow card. Very nice. But that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. I'm going to go put this box up on the shelf. If you guys could please leave a comment, like, and subscribe, I'd greatly appreciate it, and have a great day.